Is my mirror gonna hit it? Your standard's getting a little close. close to just starting to rig this thing out the old-fashioned way but the lure of the crane kind of did its lure thing and it lured me in and now look but we can fix that so we protected everything we could see and then this one was under the grass like there was no way to see it this junction box was down completely covered under the lawn somewhere. I could have had, because now we're off to the hardware store, that's like the water to the house. I could have had that side nearly stripped out by now and I'd be onto that side. So sometimes these, these really big, cool, fancy devices end up, um, you know, it's uh, pros and cons. This is the pro, who's the con? You're the convict. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, I was gonna say, if you could boom down, that would probably open me up here. There it is, okay. Uh, yeah, it's, it's off. Yeah, yeah, it's oriented the best it's going to be, probably. Okay, you, that's probably the most you want to go down for a minute, or else we might start hooking on that other limb. Did you have to dig anymore? Nope. I'll let that set up for a few, maybe a couple crane picks, and then I'll tell them it's good to go. Tree work is cool. You get to multitask. You still got the tree to get rid of, and so in between your uh, undoing the tree, you undo your mistakes. There was no shouting, arguing, and stress from the client or the crew. Everybody super happy and I have like cool like man dirt like you know on me and feeling of accomplishment <laughs> so much bigger when you get up close to them even that I'm like look at that tiny pick but it's like 35 feet long and
Okay, hold it. But I'm gonna cut this cable and it's actually really slacked off now. It was really tight. So it should be pretty predictable. Ping! All right, the DeWalt isn't working. I love wood picks. I really do. Yeah. Die old. What's that? Thank you. That was nice and smooth. Awesome. I think we can get this and. Probably two pieces. That cut is like... fits the shape of the space which is a redundant saying of the same thing for your wisdom also Yeah, yeah, I tried to make it so it would slide out like that. Maybe, maybe boom up just barely. Thank you. 
screw them up. Yeah, I think it was pretty good tension though. And I think that butt line did help it not do the whole, you know, where you tip tie something and slice it off and it like a really abruptly slams back, you know? is set to kind of come towards me a little bit. I think I'm going to undercut as much as I can and make a little shelf. Evil Empire passing all the way to the top. Yeah, I, I, I like it just got it. you too. I'll tell you next time. <laughs> yeah, that's just because uh, we haven't had you do any yet. Well, you're officially my best friend for the day. Nobody else went to do that. Yeah. Oh, I want to be your best friend. I'll do it next time. No. There might not be a next time. I'll remember that one. Say hi to YouTube, August. Okay, we'll see you on the last cut. Peace out. Ha <laughs> ha!
<laughs> yeah. Oh, here comes back. <laughs> yeah, a pretty good boom operator there. Yeah, he's a good, awesome. he's a really good climber too. Is he? Yeah, he could climb that thing, no problem. Yeah, he's You're way good. better, way better than Damien. That's for sure. <laughs> he's oh, getting, listen. he's getting good. He's, he's, he's getting good. <laughs> He gets a little better with each thing I teach him, you know? <laughs> you just start listening a little bit. Yeah, yeah. if you just start li <laughs> Yeah. He's kind of a hard ass. Was well, he going to leave that on the flatbed? I think he's going to put it on the flatbed, yeah. I guess I'm going to eat some potato salad real fast. Well, you let the RPMs down once. Don't even think about it. Yeah, you're just a clean cut guy. Mm -hmm. 